This video is sponsored by Intel. Hey everyone, it's Andrew over at Exotic PC, and today we're coming to you with another update on our Intel Extreme Rig Challenge build. Today's video is kind of focused around the core of the machine, so we're gonna be going over the Intel processor that is involved with it, as well as the cooling system that we are going to be using on our Extreme Rig. But the other thing you should be notified on, or if you don't know, is how to vote for your chance to win an extreme rig and give us a vote which will definitely help us in the standing. Now to vote for us, what you're gonna want to do is vote on Twitter by casting a hashtag with Intel Rig Challenge and tagging us at Exotic PC. It can automatically vote for you as well if you just head over to that page and select on the team that you wanna vote for and then of course hit vote. And of course, make sure that you follow us on our social media so you get all the updates as well over there. But all of that aside, let's jump in and take a look at the CPU that we will be using in our Extreme Rig. So here's the processor that we will be using in our build, graciously provided by Intel. It is the i9-7980XE processor. It's an 18-core, 36-thread processor. Plenty of multitasking processes that we can do. We support Turbo Boost, and of course, we have 44 PCIe Express lanes. So lots and lots of power on the i9-7980XE processor that we will be housing in our build. Definitely a fantastic processor. So of course to cool such an extreme processor and the rest of our rig, we're gonna need some pretty awesome cooling hardware as well. So let's go over actually a few of the core components that are gonna be uh, kind of an essential to our cooling loop that will be in our PC. So the first thing let's talk about is the EKX Top Revo D5 RGB pump. So we're gonna actually be having two of these in our build um, because we're gonna do something a little bit special with our uh, with our loop in this one. But we're gonna be using two of these. Um, we have the RGB ring around the X or around the outside of it. And of course we have you know the D5 pump as the base to this EK um, you know D5. So a very powerful pump um, and you know a very good looking pump as well that will fit the aesthetic of our build and also have all the power and capacity to obviously move a lot of liquid around to keep things nice and cool. And then of course you need to team up your pump with a good radiator. So of course we're going up with our tried and true that we use around Exotic PC, which is our Aqua computer radiators. And for this one, we're gonna be using two 360 mil radiators. So obviously a lot of cooling um, ca capabilities uh, and potential overall in this build, so lots and lots of radiator support for this so we can keep things nice and cool, which is exactly what you want in an extreme rig. And uh, obviously aesthetics and cooling, those things go, go together when you're doing water cooling and to kind of keep everything in our RGB, uh, not theme, but you know, being able to keep the RGB you know, going and keeping it alive. We're gonna also have that in our fans, which will be the Thermaltake Ring Plus fans. So tons of RGB controllability, also very, very good at moving good amounts of airflow through your radiators as well. So we'll have controllable RGB through our fans, through our pumps, and we're just gonna have an RGB party really, it seems like. So um, all those you have the possibility to do, or if you don't, you can just turn it off if you're not an RGB person, but definitely, we're gonna have the hookup on the RGB for this build because why not? So plenty of radiator support, plenty of pump support, and good fans moving a lot of air across those radiators will result in a very, very cool build, of course, which is great when you're doing SLI and you have lots and lots of power in those cores on that i9. So we're definitely gonna be set up for an extreme rig. Thanks again for checking out our second video on our Intel Extreme Rig Challenge build. Be sure that you're voting for us. We'll link you up down below in the description so you can do so. You'll have yourself, you'll give yourself a chance to win an Extreme Rig. Why not do so? Vote for us every day. Thank you. Other than that, we also want to thank Intel as well for their support on this project. And look forward to our third video coming up in the future where we will be showing you our build, not just parts. I mean, I'll talk about some more parts too, but I'll show you all of it coming together. Should be great. Follow us on social media as well for other updates on the build, and we'll see all of you next time. Thanks again to Intel for providing us with the Asus ROG Strix X299 gaming motherboard, the Intel i9 Extreme Edition processor, and the Intel Optane SSD 900P.